Hey people, what's popping? Dera Gizia, Ogini Nafio. <laughs> copy, copy, do me. Eh, 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 do you, eh. I don't have my own trade song, so I'll form my own very soon. Let's let's get out of here. Hey y'all, what's up and welcome to my YouTube channel. It is Sonia here. If you're new, thank you so much for stopping by. If you are a returning subscriber, ah, thank you so much, you tried. So in this video, we're going to be doing a cream review. Yes, we're going to be reviewing a body lotion. Okay, it has been all over the place and I know quite a lot of people that have used it. Personally, I have used it and I also recommended it to like three other persons and they also used it this um, cream so in this video we are going to be reviewing that body lotion okay so without further ado let's get into it so um the cream that we're talking about today is brownstone i know like a lot of people have heard about brownstone if you're watching this video maybe you've heard about brownstone or you want to buy brownstone anyway so um this um this cream it cost um, 1,500 Naira as at the time that I was using it. That was like um, two years ago. Not up to like two years ago, but you know, we're in a new year and you say two years ago, it looks like it's far, but I used it like two years ago. I started using it two years ago and I used like three bottles of it. I went over like three bottles and my friend and my roommates, she used like two bottles of it. And plus another acquaintance of ours, she also used um, the lotion. Yeah, so, and then I knew quite a number of people that used the lotion and, you know, yeah. So the lotion has, it comes in a set, like you can buy the lotion on its own, but it has like other range of products in the set, brownstone. It has the soap, it has the black spots corrector. It has, um, does it have a serum? I don't know if it has serum, Sha, but I think I'm going to insert a picture of what I'm talking about. I'll insert a picture of what I'm talking about. Anyway, so I saw reviews about this lotion online. I saw a lot of reviews because I'm the kind of person that before I buy a body lotion, I'll always go online to check reviews about this um, this cream or whatever so i saw like really good reviews people talking about it like ah that the lotion is good that it doesn't like make you white it doesn't like bleach you or something like that it doesn't bleach you it just lightens your complexion bronze tone okay bronze it gives you a bronze like caramel sort of look and that it's okay for people that have um dark chocolate skin like people that have my type of skin tone anyway so i saw like really really good reviews on this lotion like positive reviews and all that so i now went on ahead to buy it i bought the cream i used it for like a week it was beautiful the second week it was still good my color was so like like was really pretty and i then started using the soap okay i also bought the bronze stone soap so i was using both the cream and the soap and i was using it like my face was looking good and all that like until after that um after that bottle okay i just noticed that my face wasn't like glowing as it used to be so i kind of like blamed it on the weather maybe because the weather is hot i blamed it on water i just blamed it on hygiene like i felt like because I was in the school hostel, maybe it's just water and everything that I'm using to take my bath. Maybe I needed dental, you know, that kind of a thing. Maybe I just needed to like take care of my body properly because then I used to apply the same um, body lotion on my face. Like I didn't have a, a separate um, body lotion. I didn't, I didn't care to have a face cream. Anyway, so I just kept on using this, using the body lotion. At the end of the day, my face was dark. I, I used the first bottle, like after, when I was done with the first bottle, like I said, I now blamed it on a whole lot of other things. Then I bought the second bottle. Yeah, I bought the second bottle. I think actually I was the one that used two bottles while my friend used like three bottles. 
So I now bought the second bottle. Like this cream is actually, it smells very good. It smells like um like chocolate. It smells like it's it has a good um fragrance to it. So I really liked it. So I now bought the second one. Now this second one I bought as I was not using it, I was still using it now with the soap and everything. I started having dark knuckles, like my knuckles became so black, like so dark. Naturally, like normally, my knuckles aren't like that fair or anything. These are how my hands are naturally from birth. I've always known my hands to be like this. Primary school, secondary school, my hands has always been like this. But then it got worse than this. At this place, like this place now became so, so white. Like this place became very, very white. And this particular place became so black, like as black as this. It was actually a very big issue. I was now feeling uncomfortable. Like I couldn't like just raise up my hands the normal way. It was just like obvious that I was bleaching. Like my hands was almost looking like roasted plantain, something like that. So it started also affecting my legs. My legs were now bleached somehow. I had like black spots, I like dark dark patches. On my leg and um, other parts of my body when I'm extremely fair my hands were so 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 fair like so very fair and it wasn't act actually um wasn't looking palatable one not they were funny it wasn't really funny to me anyway so I just discontinued um, using that cream it wasn't good the cream states that there is no hydroquinone in it but then I feel like there is something that is hiding in between the ingredients that they stated um, because all the ingredients that they stated at the back of this lotion it was all good there was nothing alarming about the ingredients everything looked safe like everything felt safe it states that it is hydroquinone free it says it contains cocoa it contains honey and all that but then it's not a good it's not a good cream it's actually a bleaching cream it took me another one month for me to get my skin back to how it used to like not like totally back to how we used to but it took me a while for me to like get my 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 skin tone back and i also want to say that we should be mindful of creams that are made in Cote d'Ivoire i feel like they have this reputation of making bleaching creams i don't know why but majority of the products that i've seen made in Cote d'Ivoire are bleaching creams I don't know i don't know why it's like that now obviously i'm not going to repurchase this cream and I, I wouldn't even advise anybody that i know to um repurchase the cream and i also want to advise you to be mindful of the kind of reviews that you read um on online we should be mindful of the reviews that we see even till date i still see reviews on this cream and people come and say ah this cream is actually good and all that and all that Go and ask that person one month after using the cream. The person will have negative things to say. So um, just like when I was using the cream, it was like that first two weeks that I was using the cream, my skin was really glowing and people saw me and they were always asking me, ah, your body, your complexion is popping. This one is looking good. It's looking good and all that. And then because it was good on me, they now went to go and buy it. At the long run, what now happened? It failed. So... Um, I think that natural is always best and I wouldn't advise anybody to go and buy that um, buy bronze stone or whatever or even any lightning cream whatsoever I think we should just like try to invest in good skincare like good skincare forget about all these lightning things eat good food drink water um, reduce stress rest um, all those things would actually contribute to a glowing skin rather than spending um, little or a lot on a on a particular product and then at the end of the day it ruins your your beautiful complexion so well that is all i have to say about this body lotion i hope that you enjoyed this video please do give this video a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and i'm going to be posting more honest reviews and yeah, turn on the notification bell so that you'll be notified anytime that I upload a new video. I will be seeing you in my next one.